Alright, so Dog has a little more trouble with this matchup. Uh, it is inherently Peach one of Pikachu's worst matchups in the game. And Bear instantly gets the standard. He's a big fan of the standard. Also, he has a couple different ways that he likes to end combos. If he can't get the standard, or if it's a little bit too risky in that if he misses it, he'll definitely die. Sometimes he'll go for the Nair. Uh, which is something that you don't see quite as often. A lot of people try and go for the Dare. The Nair is actually a great option just to get them far away from the stage. Alright, Edgar from Dog there. Great patience by DeBear. There's not anything that Pikachu can, Pikachu can do about that back air. He really lucked out on that one. Really strange sequence. The winner of this game will play Mad Rush. Completely even stocks. This matchup goes really quick. Misses a Z cancel on there, does not get punished. Going for the standard, that's going to be the stock. And another standard. But that won't kill. He wasn't quite close enough to the side. Coming down the last stock. Oh man, he's not able to close out that edge guard. Just opts for the jab. And now we go for this neutral game. Which Falcon is definitely uh, has the advantage against Pikachu in this neutral game. Especially because once you get the knockdown, Falcon has the ability to tech chase anywhere on the stage, whereas Pikachu cannot always get Falcon's rolls depending on where he's hit. That's going to be game one to Dog. No DeBear maybe pondering a switch? No, okay, well, we see a switch from Dog, actually. Three, two, one, this is an interesting turn of events. He had a lot of trouble with, uh, I believe it was God's. Falcon as well. And ended up losing that set. See if he gets this gimp. All right, good job there. Dog taking the lead with his Mario. He's playing a lot of Mario today. It's a lot of it has to do with uh, the fact that he's run into a good portion of Falcons, and he's totally fine with gimping Falcon with either Pikachu or Mario, as you can see right there. Oh, great spike, great spike. Sorry, I was over there taking care of some. Yeah, business. yeah, yeah. You gotta, you gotta dish out that that cold hard cash. That's that's what they call me, cold hard cash Joe. Nobody calls me that. <laughs> Great double down. What a there, terrible right nickname. <laughs> <laughs> I hope nobody calls me that. Yeah, it has been cool seeing Dog play Mario so much today. Oh. Clean moves from the bear. Good, good down tilt. Covers the option. This is neck and neck, man. Yep. This is looking really good. I'm a little surprised that uh, DeBear didn't go with the Pikachu in this. Um, some some Pikas don't actually prefer this matchup. Like, so I'm, I'm not sure about Dog, but I know 
and a lot of people prefer to play Falcon into Pika over the Lexus and like Kirby and whatnot. Mm -hmm. So I can imagine that it's probably the opposite. Oh man, that, that is well. okay. Both of those magic attacks missed. It's a pretty even match so far. Oh, misses the Z cancel. That could have been a jab grab. He's doing a lot of these defensive up airs. Uh, and the bear's not really getting caught by him. He's just running away and uh, waiting for those options to happen. Mostly because Falcon could cover uh, anything that Mario throws out afterwards. Out of shield up smash. Almost takes care of him. He's going to need to hit a few moves now, though, before it's unstaled a little bit. Good fireball. Covers it. And a forward smash will seal the stop. I'm not a fan of DeBear's recoveries right now. Uh, like, if you look back to the set with uh, Dog versus God, Ooh. God was always going to die for that, oh, though. Oh, man. God was uh, fading back to ledge and really getting that, that low sweet spot to where... Mm -hmm. Dog was having a really hard time covering it. Here's the up airs. Oh, misses at the end, but sets up again. Not too bad. See, I like I like that nair. It gets him gets him off stage. Oh, it's an he, unconventional option. He's reaching. This would uh, this would be pretty big. This would be if, a, if a big upset. I don't think he's ever bear. beaten to bear. He was really well hoping to get caught. Done. Yeah, well done. Just fade away. Dog up 2-0 against the bear. This is big. This is big. I don't think he, I'm pretty sure he's never beaten them. He's beaten everybody else. He, now he's playing jigs. Oh my god. Once, once. Okay. All right. Well, he's just running through his cast of characters. He's playing jiggles now. Dang, dude. Hey, no, uh, no, no Kirby no. Pika. That's true. That is. We got true. some serious character diversity in this. I think we've seen. I'm trying to think if we've seen between the whole doubles cast. and singles. I think the only thing we're no, we've s we saw Luigi, saw Mario, saw Pikachu. We haven't seen a Link. Have, yeah, we? there's no, there's been no Link. I think there was one off stream for one match. I think Jacob. I bet it, yeah, but it. I think we we've seen 11 out of 12 characters. Which is pretty good. Pretty nice diversity. Yeah, it's just so, too bad up. we didn't have a uh, those betting cards, the Smash Bingo. Dog on the legendary 69 with Jigglypuff, man. Up a stock already. Oh, catches him out. Nice I'm really surprised upper. that he's playing his whole, like, all, all of his different characters. This isn't like him at all. He he's, normally sticks he's really Pika, feeling himself all, all Pika all the time. Well, I talked with Dog a little bit after his match with Hipster, and he said after game three, he was like, okay. I'm, I'm feeling my options now with Pikachu. Mm -hmm. So usually in that case, you feel comfortable trying some different stuff too. He's playing really well right now, though, man. The fact that he's able to pull out Mario, Jigglypuff, pull out Mar yeah, Pikachu he, is... He's playing three different characters and he's beating them in every game. And they're not... They, they're convincing wins, but they're not blowout wins. It's no, not. He's, he's not like sandbagging and just picking different characters. Yeah. It, he can't just sleep wait on Way to wait on that, though, with the uh, with the delayed back air by DeBear. He's keeping himself in this one. I'll be honest. If Dog wins this 3-0 with a Jigglypuff, I'd be pretty surprised. The double oh. Falcon Punch. Oh, but Jig Jigs He'll can't take make that, that back. Yeah. take that. I don't know if he's going to... Uh, that's not a good trade for him, because Falcon was at high percent off stage. <laughs> Jigs had nothing, and he killed himself at zero. Right now, I think he's just looking for some style points. See, that's what's confusing me. He's just like going through his characters, but there's there's a, there's some money on the line. This is like the most serious tournament that we've had in state for 64. Yeah, for sure. Nice neutral air spacing with the most uh, out of town talent across the entire country. Both both players shaking their heads like, nah, this isn't that's that shouldn't work. This is the first time. Oh, I love that. When was the last Good way time to get started with the standard. Uh, when was the last time he had a lead? Mm -hmm. I think he had a lead game one. Game one. Okay. Yeah. You never know though, because if you if you look back to whenever they play doubles, when these guys play All right. tan dog in them, game to the bear. Can he pull off the 3-0 comeback? 
because because the the prediction and I've been saying this a long time is that it was going to be D10 bark to bear, but in any order. I don't know what the order was going to sure. be. Sure, I feel D10 like that's a barely safe bet. barely beat bark. What an what an incredibly like tense set. Now All right, we're seeing him switch back. Yeah. Here's the part that I'm curious though for. Jacob is a really strong swing player mm -hmm. to bear, so he was down 2-0, and he gets this. Not not a gimme, but a kind of easy game comparatively to playing dogs. Pikachu. Right. Is is that enough for Jacob to start feeling himself again and to kind of turn it on for two more games? Or is is dog still in, in charge and just gonna crush him? Um Boy, I feel like Jacob's actually playing he's he's actually playing really well. Mm -hmm. Uh but he's not overwhelming dog. That's normally what happens when these yeah. two play. Uh Historically, oh wow, okay, that was a tricky, tricky recovery. Historically, when these two play, uh, the bear will absolutely roll over him, and it, it's it's not like dog couldn't win. It's just that he gets com he gets very discouraged, sure. and he's like, well, I can't deal with everything that's happening right now, and uh, eventually by game three, it's like a four stock or something like that. That's just that's just how it has been in the past. Sure. Um, but now he he has this 2-1 lead. He had a 2-0 lead. He's now he's switched back to his main character. Mm. The guy's the first. We'll see. One. He's converting a lot more. I like the down tilt. Didn't work out for him. Ooh. Catches him that with that up tilt. That should be another. Yep. Dog is just playing really well. Really conserved. So the winner of this face is Mad, Mad Rush. Rush. Okay. Yeah. Well, Mad nice Rush, wait. Mad, or sorry, uh, the bear has a quite a comeback to to make right here, and then another game on top of it, which is this is absolutely possible. Th this matchup is uh, especially with one of those happening, especially with those happening, and that's that's normally what you see. So um, a lot of the times, there's the start. Oh. Like, you you'll know that dog is breaking when he starts missing his up bees. He starts uh, flubbing on his edge guards. Just put the input at the wrong time. He did the right move, like he's done it a million times, but he just, uh, for some reason, messed up the timing. One of the things DeBear has been really successful with is the delayed back air. Yeah, absolutely. He's been, he's been catching been... Dog with it this this game pretty consistently. He does it just before he hits the ground. Gets him off stage. Wow, now it's an even it's game. Right back. So I like that uh, recovery option from the bear getting off the ledge. Oh, he's not, he's gonna die from that. Getting off the ledge, he Tournament rolls stock. up and immediately runs away. He doesn't try and do any action out of it. Uh, but he's he's waiting for. All oh, right, standard brings it back. One one, one one. He waits for an action and then rolls up and runs away. Let's see, he's going to be looking for probably a back air into a grab, if possible. I'd be surprised if Dog gives him a free grab. Ooh, this is going to be tough. That's going to be it. Oh, oh man, that's it. That's it, man. Dog, 3-1.